Rachel and I have been working together for seven and a half years, and at this stage, um, I probably learn more from Rachel than she does from me. So our mentor-mentee relationship certainly is different today than it was when we met. Immediately from the first day, I recognized in Rachel similar values to mine and a similar long-term perspective, but a totally different personality and a totally different background. My kind of task, I think, from day one was just to help Rachel develop into the professional she is now with her approach, not my approach. And it's worked great for her and it's worked great for our firm. I think one of the you know, most important aspects of having Simon as a mentor is that you have this trusted relationship where you can develop, bounce ideas off, build confidence, and at the end of the day, much of our business, much of the industry in general is based on judgment. So having a trusted resource, trusted perspective that you can use to develop that is critical in building your confidence and judgment as a professional. We really only succeed if we can build multi-decade relationships with our clients, which fortunately we've been able to do, but to do that and do it well, we actually need people doing what Rachel and I do for multi-decades. It has been our approach generally to take a sort of an apprenticeship model, hire people with varied experience, not exactly relevant necessarily for what we do, but uh, important investment experience, no less, and develop them over many years. And, and, and so that's just, that's been the way we've always done it, and it's critical to our success. It's just a natural fit for a kind of mentor-mentee model, where ultimately you need to build confidence, build your own voice. You know, as, a, as um, we've discussed before, Rachel and I have similar values, but have very different personalities and very different styles. And what works best for our firm is for each of us to express our sort of shared value set with our own personality and our own styles. I think one of the things that makes us really unique is that we genuinely want people to succeed. And that translates to different things at different stages of our careers. Because to succeed, we need people to stay at our firm. We, I believe, have done a better job than most at hiring very bright, bright people with different backgrounds than the kind of current senior leadership of the firm with the expectation that these people one day will run the firm. And, and if the bar is uh, thoughtful, long-term focused, creative talent and not mini-me, that enables you to actually fish from a much bigger pond. We uh, really want to grow, develop, and build the next leaders of the firm. And that has contributed to both of our success significantly to date. And I think in this industry is really unique. There's always a caution of if I, this person is too successful, how can it impede on my own success? And that is just completely absent in our firm. That makes it a, I think, a really special firm, a unique experience, and has enabled us to hire, retain, and develop exceptional people.